All right, you're a painting contractor and you clicked on my ad because you're looking to get more phone calls for qualified contracting estimates. Can't make you get the job, but I can make your phone ring. And you're currently paying for search engine optimization. Uh, <clears throat> and uh, it's just not really paying off the way you thought it would. Your phone's not ringing, which is really the only key metric that anybody should be concerned with in the uh, small business uh, service sector. So, hello, my name is Bob Rutledge. I'm going to answer some questions for you about how to fix your situation with your search engine optimization. I've been running a company called Micromanage Media. I have exclusively serviced uh, service contractors like plumbers and heating and air and painting contractors, roofing contractors for two decades. Uh, yes, I have been around longer than Google. So uh, don't ask me for any investment advice because it could have bought Google at $58 or something like that. It's probably $1,800 today. And I thought it was overpriced at $58. But what did I know? But you can ask me about what are discovery keywords. Well, discovery keywords are how are, are, are words that will generate traffic to your website that will bring you new customers and make your phone ring. Traffic is not the issue. We could come up with some crazy keywords to, to put on your website to write articles about, to, to link, you know, to do title tags, yada, yada with. And we could boost your, your traffic. But it's like I've always said to, uh, well, let's make an illustration for painting contractors. Why would you want to be found for uh, colors to paint a house anywhere, really? What are the best colors to paint my house? You know, people are, that's going to get you some traffic. There's no doubt about that. But you want to be found for house painters in name the city, house painters Houston, or better yet, house painters in uh, a suburb of Houston, uh, house painters in Dallas, or better yet, a house painter in uh, what is a what is a Dallas suburb, a Plano, house painters in Plano, Texas, Plano, Texas house painters. That's a far better keyword. Those are discovery keywords. Let me illustrate. I'm going to show you some statistics. You can come up with um, similar research on your own, or you can just take what I got here. So I, I'm doing some research for a contractor, and uh, these are painting contractors in the Atlanta area. And, uh, I, I, you know, I, I went to my Google, my uh, I went to Google ads and typed in um, uh, under preview and, re, you know, to find out if your ads are showing, I typed in house painter in Roswell, Georgia, I think. And so I came up with these, these names or house painters in Atlanta or whatever. And um, so the first one was this three brothers painting, excellent website, uh, loads fast, uh, good colors, good graphics. Um, not perfect now, mind you. I would rather see something here of some work that they had done. But I'm not here to critique the website right now. I'm here to critique the keywords that this website's being found for. Now, it is being found an astronomical uh, 11,000 times a month. That's off the charts. That is, uh, you would think this guy is paying somebody a lot of money for um, marketing, for digital marketing services, and they are paying off babies. He's got 1,100 backlinks, and the traffic is coming to the website. And let's go down and take a look at where the traffic is coming from. Well, he's ranked number one for Halloween colors. Remember what I said a minute ago about being found for keywords like what are the best terms, what are the, what's the best color to paint my house? Uh, you know, the answer to that is relative, no matter where you are, but if they are in Tucson, Arizona, and you're in Atlanta, 
what good did it do? And this particular case is found for Halloween colors. And that's just awesome. It is pumping up his volume. The, the value of that word is zero. <laughs> so, uh, you know, it's just not a big deal. But he's getting traffic to his website and his search engine optimization company is charging him a lot of money. Uh, just a side note here, I'm located in South Alabama, about 15 minutes from the beach in a little town called Foley, Alabama. I work out of my house. If you are paying someone in New York City or anywhere in the state of California to do your search engine marketing, you're paying, first of all, 50% of that money is going to pay their taxes. I'm just saying, um, you need to change search engine optimization companies no matter what, but you need to get away from these New York and, uh, and California people. All right, back to the point though. Now here's a beautiful website and um, it is laid out well, got beautiful photographs on it, a great looking logo, a video on the front page, a lot of things that would make you want to come to this page, click on something, stay for a while, uh, you'll notice the request form is way down low. You know, people don't fill those things out. They're either going to call you or they're not um, and arrange an appointment. But it's a great website, great looking website. So I got to looking at the traffic on it and the traffic to this one is as much as 2,000, 1,800 people, 1,800 organic clicks a month. That is not bad in anybody's book. Remember, the previous one was 11,000 though. So let's take a look at the keywords because that's really what's important. You can see how this website has grown over the years. Now, the name of that company is, I'm thinking I pronounce it Philo, Philo, Philo Painting. And of course, they're showing up for their brand name. That is their brand name. Okay. It's all over their website. Uh, if you go back to the Three Brothers one, it's certainly in the logo here. Uh, it's, it's right there. Welcome to Three Brothers. And they are showing up for Three Brothers Painting. Excellent number of times a month, 290. That's not bad in any market. This one was um, 210. Uh, add the city that they're located in, which is a suburb of the Atlanta area. Um, you get another 90 more. But the rest of these keywords that are driving some traffic there um, is irrelevant. I mean, you want to establish the, these types of words would help you establish yourself uh, in uh, to, to be a, 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 a master or a, a prominent person in your market, but they're not really going to, they're not converting words. And neither is the brand name. Your brand name, you should always pick and choose wisely because it is going to be the cheapest um, way that you will ever get traffic to your website. But none of these are true discovery keywords. So let's keep searching. I went to another website in the Atlanta market called Dixon Painting. Boy, that's a beautiful photograph on their front page, whether they painted it or not, or this is a, a piece of, um, I would imagine this is a piece, this is a clip art uh, that you can probably purchase. It's beautiful. Uh, got the different categories of painting. Uh, they even install gutters. Um, it's just a darn good website. And it clicks all the uh, all the check marks, all the boxes off for me. Uh, it's uh, powered by someone called Liquid IQ. And um, so we know they are. This is not a homemade website. And they are paying a search engine optimization fee. Probably a pretty stout one. And if they only go by the organic traffic to the website, you can see that it, especially during this time of year, um, well, they're only showing, this is not a very old website, but you can see in the last month or so, it is climbing. And so they're, that's pretty good for uh, a seasonal type business for their, um, especially during uh, Christmas, you know, the, the time from November till now, uh, that's pretty good, but let's see if what kind of 
it, uh, traffic it is. And Dixon Painting is one of them. Dixon Painting Marietta, Dixon Painting Georgia. Wow. I mean, they, I believe these people may be doing some radio advertising. They're doing some kind of brand awareness thing because I've been to Atlanta and I'm almost certain that I've heard the name uh, on the radio. Uh, you can see a competitive positions map down here. And this was on all three of these. Uh, Dixon's right there, 603 um, keywords, 619 traffic per month, uh, one man and a brush. And I think we're going to have that one come up next. Shows up quite a bit. Traffic uh, back here is uh, Painting Plus. Uh, their traffic is, is uh, okay. And then you get down to Fresh Coat Marietta and some others. So the uh, you can see that the difference between, let's just, for instance, say Painting Plus and Dixon is 300% more traffic, certainly 250% more traffic coming to the website organically. Uh, but again, most of it is, is from uh, the brand name. But look right here. Uh, they are number two for House Painting Marietta, Georgia. And that's a pretty good keyword. It's valued at $12 a click. Um, I don't know. I mean, the percentage of traffic is still just 3%. So it, it needs to be, but that's a darn good keyword. That's, the, that's what we're talking about here. This is discovery keywords that will bring new people. See, if somebody already knows that they're looking for Dixon painting, that's not a discovery keyword. A discovery keyword is when you don't know what house painter you're looking for, and you type in house painters in Marietta, house painters in Plano, Texas, house painters in the Woodlands, Texas, whatever, uh, house painters Charlotte. You're going to you're looking because you don't really have one way or the other for uh, you don't have a, a, a house painter's name in mind. So this is a discovery keyword here. This is what your ha your website needs to be ranked for. Of course, your brand name it needs to be ranked for. But some of these other words that you saw on the others are just fluff. So this guy not only has good traffic, but it's not astronomical. It's half of the last one, and it's and you remember the other one was one tenth of the previous one. But this one's getting into traffic that really counts. This these are branded keywords and discovery keywords that are going to make this guy's phone ring. All right. The next one let's take a look at is um, painting Plus's traffic. And again, they are coming up for, well, I didn't, I don't have their website up here. Let me look that up right quick. Okay, there is their website coming up. It's a little slow. Um, but there's their website. And um, it's all right. Got a little, uh, let's take a look at the traffic though. This website has been around for a long time. Uh, 2013, even beyond. 2012 is the first when Google started uh, tracking the history of it. So this website alone for its history should be ranking well. It shows that it has about 300 uh, organic traffic a day in the month of February, 310. Okay, so it's half of the previous one. Um, let's go down and look at the source of this traffic. Painting Plus Atlanta, again, a branded keyword. Painting Plus Inc., a branded keyword, Painting Plus Atlanta. Paint Plus. Now, Atlanta Painting is a discovery keyword. And so they are, they are at least getting some traffic, uh, but not much from, well, it says 10% of the traffic is, 11% of the traffic is coming from Atlanta Painting. Uh, that could be construed several ways. It's still not specific enough, let's say, for, house painting or for interior painting, but still 
That's a good keyword to show up for. They're in the ninth position. Um, they need to be on up in the, you need to be up in the top two or three though, if you're ever going to get that many clicks. So they've got traffic coming to their website. Now let's talk about one that I think is doing an outstanding job. Let's go back to their homepage and it is nothing to write home about. It is really kind of very, well, it's very dated looking. The, um, uh, Having the outline, I haven't done a website like this in over 10 years, laid out with that box around it like that. Uh, let's see what it looks like on, um, I'm going to do a, a quick check of a, uh, uh, let's, no, let's do it this way, a rendering of the website to see what it looks like as a uh, smartphone. So, you know, I'm wondering if you push that page, will it cause the phone number to be dialed? I don't, to send a number. Okay, so it might. Yeah, it might. Very good. But, uh, you know, it's nothing right home about. It's, um, but it is a decent looking website on a smartphone, which is where 60 or 70% of all your traffic is going to come from nowadays. Now, let's. here's what I'm impressed about this uh, website. One man in a brush, one man in a brush. That is their business name, I guess. Um, one man, I mean, it's certainly their logo. I guess one man, that's their business company name. But not that many people are looking it up that way. Uh, how they are looking it up is all A-L-L. I am so impressed by this. Um, keywords that help them get found. Um, discovery keywords, house painting, Marietta, Georgia. So, it's, you know, it's, again, you can be found for house painting, but if you're in Tupelo, Mississippi, and they're looking in Charlotte, North Carolina, what good did it do you? You need to be found for house painting and then your city. Painters, Woodstock, exterior house painting, Roswell. These are all... Um, very good uh, discovery keywords. I can guarantee you that keyword is more expensive than that. It's not a gigantic volume, um, but uh, I, I guarantee you these keywords are a lot more. House painters, Woodstock, Atlanta painting. So he's one position, if I remember right, right below painting plus. So I hope this has been some help to you. I hope that you're understanding that when your search engine optimization company tells you that they're sending you lots of traffic, I mean, again, let's go back and review this. 11,000. One-tenth of that. Half of that. Half of that. And then this one went back up to the amount that the a couple before had, but these are all, uh, or there's a big, big mixture in here of discovery keywords. Now, part of the problem might be their brand name is not just not something people would go looking for, one man in a brush. I mean, I know it's a takeoff on two guys in a truck or something like that, but they need to come up with, um, they need to come up with a brand name, uh, and, and uh, that would help, I think, bring them even more traffic. But the fact that they're writing for these discovery keywords is really the most important thing. People who are going to call one man in a brush are going to call one man in a brush. Uh, but if somebody's in Marietta looking for a house painter and they really have no preference, it is good to be number one. So if this has been helpful to you and you are looking for someone to straighten out your search engine marketing, do not hesitate to give me a call. I am looking for painting contractors that I can help grow their business and make their phone ring. Good luck.